All right, here's a slightly uh, more difficult one. Very similar to the previous video. We have a series that depends on a variable x. And we want to find all of the positive values of x that make this series converge. The answer is, is to be an interval. So our first step is to transform R, or transform uh, A n into the form. Uh, remember, this is the, this is the rule A n. And we want to transform that into the form where uh, A n equals C, where C is a constant. Oops, I guess we, um, C times R to the n. R is the ratio, so R is the ratio. Uh, C is a constant. All right, so let's see. A n is x to the 3 n. Give myself a little more room here. A n equals x to the 3 n over 8 to the n. All right, so now the idea is we want to write um, the denominator, a to the n, as something to the 3n. Because then we'll be able to, so let's see, x to the 3n over something to the 3n. This is equal to x over something the 3n. Then this will be our, um, this, then whatever this is, this will be our r. We'll be, use, we'll be able to use the, uh, the fact that geometric series uh, converge when r is between negative 1 and 1. So what is question mark? All right, so let's see. Remember that 8 is 2 cubed. So 8 to the n, we can think of as, maybe let's first write it like this, 8 to the n, right? It's the same thing. This is equal to 2 cubed to the n. And now using a rule of exponents, remember that, uh, let's see, when you have, um, you've seen it, probably seen it this way before, x to the m to the n is equal to x to the m times n. And so we're using that same idea here. Um, this is 2 to the 3n. So that tells us that question mark is 2. So we'll write that in there, 2. I didn't like my messy handwriting with my stylus. Oh man, the stylus is taking my messy handwriting and made it worse. Okay, so we have x over 2 to the 3n. All right, so now remember, so uh, now this is r. Right, that's our r. r is x over 2. So now remembering that a geometric series converges when uh, r is between negative 1 and 1. We can say we can go negative 1 and 1, negative 1, x over 2, 1, negative 2, x. 2, and our answer is going to be negative 2, 2. There it is.